And now the night everyone in the football world has been longing for. Millions will be watching around the world. It is, of course, the biggest final in club football, the UEFA Champions League final. Welcome to the commentary box. Derek Ray here, joined by Stuart Robson. It's Fenerbahce taking on Liverpool. Well, what a night, Derek. Two great teams, a perfect pitch, a magnificent stadium, and millions watching around the world. What more could you ask for, apart from maybe different commentators? And here's the Fenerbahce lineup. Well, they're set up to be solid defensively. Two banks of four, staying as compact as possible, but it might just leave the front to a little bit isolated. The wide players will need to break forward as quickly as possible. And this is how Liverpool will line up. Alisson begins in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander-Arnold in the fullback positions. Mohamed Salah plays with Diogo Jota in the wide positions. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And now the Champions League final commences. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. And let's give credit to the defending. Well, play stopped. It is a free kick. And going short with it. And through for the goal kick. He hit it with power. Curtis Jones. And there to intervene. And you don't want to lose possession there. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Can someone get on the end of this? Not away completely. Oh, a powerful effort. Close. Free kick awarded to Liverpool. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. William Arau. Ferdi Cadioglu. It's with Rossi. Now, do they mean business on this occasion? Well, it came to nothing in the end. And he takes it on. Will this corner bear fruit for them? Well, it has come to nothing. Very quick thinking there. Well, not quite precise enough when all was said and done. Ooh. 
Diogo Jota. What a creative look about this. But the danger averted for now. Well, as the stats show us, this has been a really even game so far. There just hasn't been enough guile or invention in the top third of the field from either team, which needs to change at some point. And they've scored! First goal in this season's UEFA Champions League final. And Liverpool get the ball moving again, looking to find a reply to that setback. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Irfan Chan Kavici. Oh, did so well to deny him. Taken short. And so the referee blows the whistle. We've reached. Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. Alexander Arnold. Mo Salah. It's with Michi Batshuayi. This is looking threatening, but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Henderson. Nicely timed tackle. Valencia. And Fenerbahce come away with it. It's there for him. And a fine stop. And time for the change now. Over it comes. Taking care of business defensively here. Giving them a different option by moving in field. Well, he's just spooned it over the top. Gakpo. It's with Fabinho. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And the pass could do damage. Is it going to be? Couldn't grab hold of it. But it looked so threatening, but the danger averted. Well, that could prove to be a big moment in the game. Had that gone in, I couldn't see a way back for them. But Alisson has just given them some hope with that save. It's there for him. And the keeper more than equal to the task. And the referee has given the corner. So maybe scope here for them to add to their lead. Gakpo. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Valencia. Could play it in. And he takes it on! Well, the goalkeeper is thankful that it wasn't a better effort than it actually was. Plenty of support here. Liverpool trailing late in this game, but who knows what happens next. Henderson. Well, not the greatest pass. Easily intercepted. Might be able to set up the chance. Well, 
and it wasn't a productive cross. And there it is! Full time! They are the Champions League winners! Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. Here we go. The Champions League winners. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night.